Welcome to the next episode of Digital Supply Chain Institute Insights. Today with me, I have a pleasure to speak with Sean Muma, who is the Director for New Technologies in Digital Supply Chain Institute. And the topic we would like to cover is the topic of how Digital Supply Chain Institute is trying to stay on top of the new technologies and then as well open up opportunities for companies who are scaling up for global solutions in supply chain. Sean, welcome. Thank you, Marco. It's a pleasure to be here. Looking forward to our conversation. So, Sean, let's deep dive immediately into the arena of uh, what and why digital supply chain would like to do in the area of helping scaling up companies and how we came to that idea. Okay. Well, thank you, Marco. We uh, we have announced and uh, our uh, our uh, accepting members into our new accelerator. Uh, the accelerator is designed to uh, to assist uh, companies in uh, in scaling. Uh, what we're looking for is companies that have uh, a proven platform, uh, cap- uh, supply chain capabilities that uh, that we can uh, help them move to the uh, to the next level and help them scale. We came to uh, to recognize the need for this as a result of uh, membership in the uh, Digital Supply Chain Institute. We found that we had uh, a couple different uh, uh, classes of membership, for lack of a better word. We had the enterprise members on the uh, on the larger end of the uh, of the scale. Of course, uh, large companies, large supply chains. Uh, global in nature, and then we uh, then we had a a, a group of uh, what we call scale up members who are smaller companies uh, with interesting technologies, interesting ideas in the uh, supply chain area, uh, who uh, who were of interest to the enterprise members from a technology standpoint, uh, but uh, lacked some of the uh, the management. Uh, expertise and capabilities that they needed to succeed in uh, in the market. So we said we could bring those two together along with the uh, the skills and the capabilities that uh, DSCI has as an organization and uh, and hopefully uh, have an outcome that uh, that benefits uh, all parties within the institute. Very, very exciting and uh, interesting, Sean. And I think the the learnings uh, from the current scale-up members, as you shared, basically, uh, it's great to hear that they have built the program from uh, learning and understanding with them, you know, uh, what is the real need and then what is the capability missing. Uh, Can you share, please, for uh, the people listening, is, is there any criteria of selecting companies for the accelerator? Well, there is criteria for selecting companies in that uh, we're looking for companies that, of course, are supply chain focused. Uh, it can be in uh, it, really in, in any sector within the supply chain, but uh, offers some uh, unique technology or capabilities that uh, would benefit um, others uh, in the, uh, as, uh, as customers in the uh, supply chain uh, arena. So, you know, number one is we're not looking for startups. We're, uh, we're, we're, not, we're not looking for, uh, to, uh, to provide uh, um, office space and, and those sort of resources to companies. What we're looking for is companies that have proven capabilities that, uh, that need to scale those capabilities and uh, improve them out uh, globally. Uh, so that's, uh, that's the focus. Uh, we're a little bit different than uh, a lot of accelerators out there. And that uh, we are we're going to be company specific. The programs will be tailored to the individual company and, and customized. We're not uh, we're not cohort based like a lot of uh, uh, accelerators are. We're we're not looking to uh, to run people through a classroom and uh, and give them a certificate at the end. We're uh, we're very outcome oriented. Uh, we're looking to provide tangible ideas. Set a uh, set a series of outcomes uh, for the. Uh, the accelerator member that uh, is in line with uh, where they want to take the business and then uh, provide the support to help them uh, achieve those objectives and, uh, and we'll measure um, our, uh, our path towards those, uh, those objectives over time. And in addition, of course, we have uh, various, uh, a lot of talent uh, that uh, we can make available, uh, trusted leaders, uh, deep seasoned experience, 
and they can provide seasoned strategic insight to, to these companies. So we think we're uh, uniquely positioned and, uh, and well positioned to uh, help these companies uh, achieve their next level of growth. Thank you, Sean. It, it really crystallizes the view in a sense of being supply chain end-to-end innovation focus, that uh, it's a hands-on approach, which is tailor-made based to the needs of the selected companies in it. Now, having all these exciting things in mind, how do people can uh, uh, look into more information and then potentially apply uh, for uh, the, the evaluation for the membership in the Accelerator? Well, of course, if uh, for those who are interested, uh, go to the uh, DSCI website. There's a uh, Accelerator uh, landing page there, and uh, you'll find some more details about uh, how to contact uh, either myself or you, Marco, or uh, Sagathri uh, Kalaru, who's uh, another one of uh, our associates that's uh, involved with the Accelerator. And uh, we can take it from there once uh, once you reach out to us. Thank you very much, Ron. And before we close this uh, session, is there anything else you would like to add to the audience at the end? Well, I think it's important uh, for those uh, who are interested to understand what they, uh, what they receive and uh, in the way of benefit. Uh, so the accelerator will, uh, will provide an advisory board. The advisory board will, uh, will, uh, um, be staffed with uh, with with uh, folks that uh, are experienced from the CGE uh, DSCI uh, network, and we'll manage and administer that uh, advisory board on behalf of members. They can expect to have uh, quarterly workshops uh, with that uh, selected advisory board. In addition, we're going to be providing uh, mentoring for the uh, CEO. Uh, again, we'll uh, we'll work with the uh, CEO to uh, select the uh, the right ment- mentor that uh, matches their company and where they want to go. We'll provide targeted uh, client introductions with uh, our existing members or beyond that, and uh, access to uh, investors and uh, and stakeholders uh, going forward. So we uh, we're going to be a full service accelerator. Uh, we're uh, we're deep in talent. We're deep in connections. We're deep deep in. Uh, uh, being able to provide introductions to uh, to uh, scale up uh, members, uh, so I think that uh, there's a lot of benefits here that uh, that uh, accelerator members can expect as uh, as a result of uh, being part of uh, the DSCI accelerator. Thank you very much, Sean, uh, for being with us today in this Digital Supply Chain Institute uh, session, DSCI Insights. And uh, we really look forward to uh, the start of the accelerator and uh, it correlates directly with Digital Supply Chain Institute mission to help transformation of supply chains globally. Thank you for being with us and uh, uh, we come back soon. Okay, thank you, Marco. It was a pleasure being here with you today and uh, we certainly look forward to uh, welcoming new accelerator members to our to our uh, institute and also to the uh, yearly accelerator meetings that we'll be uh, holding um, face to face to face in the future. So thank you once again. It's a pleasure being here. Thank you, Sean, and thank you all for listening. Digital Supply Chain Institute Insights will continue.